So I recently did a video about my 2017 EDC. Now in that video, I went over my everyday carry. Now something that was asked a lot in that video, but I failed to mention was my pants. And if you would like to see that EDC video, I'll place a link in the description. So I got a lot of questions about the pants that I was wearing in that video. So these are the Vertex Delta Stretch pants. And I really like these pants because there's plenty of pockets, but it doesn't look super tactical. No one's going to think that these are like tactical pants. And I'm going to zoom out in just a moment and show you what these look like while wearing them. But the great thing about these pants is that there are a ton of pockets. So you have your standard pockets on the front, standard pockets on the back. But one of my favorite aspects about these pants are these side pockets. Now in that video, I showed you that I carry my pocket knife in one of them and my flashlight in the other. And as you can see, the side pockets are lined with leather. So it's going to be a little bit more durable as you are clipping and unclipping uh, your knife or whatever you decide to place in these pockets. Now, normally when I buy pants, I usually get size 32. So if I'm getting jeans or dress pants or anything like that, it's usually size 32. However, when I bought these pants, I actually decided to get size 34s. Now I did that because I knew that I was going to conceal carry my Glock 26 and a spare mag. So I thought with that extra bulk around me, that moving up a size, would have been good. However, now that I've worn these pants, I actually kind of regret moving up a size. I, I wish I would have stuck with size 32 because these are kind of big on me. And um, for me personally, I, I prefer a more form fitting pants. And another cool thing that you may not immediately notice is that there is a hidden pocket on the right hand side. So if you, so this is, and this might be a little bit easier once you see it on me, but uh, so this is the front right pocket, but right on the side of it, there is a zipper. And it's actually a full size pocket inside. So I could fit my entire hand right inside this hidden pocket. Now I see this as being pretty beneficial if you are, let's say you're traveling and you want to secure your wallet a little bit more than just putting it in your pocket. That's a great way to secure your wallet. Another benefit about having this full size hidden pocket is it's not something that I do, but I can see it being useful to a lot of people. And that's if you conceal carry, but you can't conceal around your waistband and you're kind of forced to pocket carry, this pocket will easily fit, let's say a 380 or even single stacks. Uh, maybe even some compact guns in here as well. So I could definitely see that being beneficial to a lot of people. And lastly, something that you're not gonna notice immediately, but you're gonna be very thankful that it has is very wide belt loops. So if you're someone that wears like a tactical EDC type belt with the Cobra clips, those Cobra clips slide through these loops without a problem. All right, so I'm gonna zoom on out and show you what these look like while wearing them. All right, so like I mentioned, these are size 34s, which is bigger than what I normally would like to wear. I wish I would have gone with size 32s, but they fit okay. Now they're really comfortable because the material is actually really stretchy. So you can easily bend your knees. You're not gonna feel like your movement is uh, restrained at all. And they have a lot of pockets but at the same time, they don't look super tactical. So I am concealed carrying, and I am gonna give you a closer look at all the pockets. So like I mentioned, there are a lot of pockets on these pants, and they're actually really deep pockets. So here's an iPhone 6S Plus, and it just gets swallowed by the pocket. I mean, that's how much room there is in these front pockets. Now the side little pockets, are really nice as well. Here's my Benchmade Mini Griptilian. And they have that leather lip that makes it a lot more durable. So other side, my flashlight. And I mentioned about the hidden pockets. So here is the normal front pocket. Now just to the side of it, you can pull the zipper up and then you have your hidden pocket. 
Now this hidden pocket is, is basically just as deep as the normal pocket. So like I mentioned, you could fit like a 380, you could fit a single stack in there pretty easily. And then you can just zip it down. Or if you're traveling and you wanna carry your wallet in there, that's also a good idea. So in the front, this is where I appendix carry my Glock and the spare mag. And I also mentioned about the loops. I like to put my, my Cobra clip on the side just so there's less bulk up here in the front. But it slides in and out of the belt loops really easily. All right, so hopefully that answers the question about what pants was I wearing in that EDC video. And I would definitely recommend these. I really like these pants. And um, you know, they're especially good for those of you that are looking for like a tactical pants, but don't want it to look tactical. These are perfect for them. And they come in a few different colors. So if you guys are interested in these pants, I will place a link in the description of where I got them. But that's all I got for you today. Thanks for watching and I'll see you on the next one.